Good evening and welcome to the 33rd annual Great American Jazz Series. This is the final concert for our series and we appreciate you all tuning in and hearing us live, well, kind of live, but live uh, on our part of it uh, for this performance. Uh, we're looking forward to playing some great music for you. We have a wonderful artist coming up after we're finished with our portion and we hope you enjoy the music. This first tune we're gonna play for you is a tune called I'm Dig. And it's going to feature on trumpet Ray Callender, on trombone Marcos Gonzalez. This is a Med Flory tune. And again, thank you for tuning in to University of North Florida and our YouTube Great American Jazz Series concert.
right, thank you. I'm Dig. Wow, wow, what a great, great tune and a great performance of that piece. This next number uh, is special because it's a tune that's written by a member of our band. Isaac Amaya wrote this great tune for us, and it's going to feature uh, Barry Sachs, Joel Klein, trumpet Noah Hannon, and uh, Tim Pickering on drums. And this is a tune called A Name to Be Remembered, uh, written by our lead trumpet, Isaac Amaya. Thank you. 
All right, thank you very much. That was the tune called A Name to Be Remembered, and it was written by uh, Isaac Amaya. So wonderful job, wonderful job. All right, we're going to do the next tune is a commission chart from a great, great uh, arranger, uh, Jonathan Raganese. And this was one of our original tune of our guest artist you're going to hear later from Emmett Cohen. And this was written specifically for this band, this instrumentation. It's called A Toast to Low or Toast to Low. And this is going to feature Ray Callender trumpet, Fernando Cruz on tenor sax, Aaron Thorla on piano, and uh, on drums, Tim Pickering. This is Toast to Low.
All right, thank you. This next piece we're going to play for you comes from the pen of the great Louis Armstrong. This is from the Billy Maxted Orchestra Library, and this was a tune that Bill Prince rearranged a little bit, uh, structured it for, for this group. It's a tune called Cornet Chop Suey. It will feature the trumpet section, Noah Hannon, Isaac Amaya, and Ray Callender. And on the piano, it'll be Aaron Thorla. Ladies and gentlemen, Cornet Chop Suey. Cornet Chop Suey, our trumpet section back there, and uh, Aaron Thorla over there on the uh, piano. This next piece we're going to play for you also comes out of the Billy Maxted Library. We're going to uh, slow it down 
just a little bit and play this tune called Savoy Blues. And uh, if my notes are correct here, we're going to have some more piano from Aaron and um, Rue Alden on the trombone and uh, Joel Klein on the Barry sax and Matt Horhoda on the clarinet. This is a tune called Savoy Blues.
Thank you very much. A tune called Savoy Blues. All right. Well, our last piece for this portion of our show. And again, we thank you for, for tuning in. This is going to be another Emmett Cohen piece from his, from his uh, CD. It's just incredible, incredible music. And uh, this is an arrangement by Jonathan Raganese on a tune called You Already Know. And this is going to feature uh, Ray Callender on the trumpet, Fernando Cruz on the tenor sax, Aaron Thorla on the piano, and uh, Tim Pickering on the drums. We want to thank you very much, and we hope you have uh, uh, a great rest of the evening when we bring out Mr. Emmett Cohen. I, I know you're going to enjoy that. We thank you for tuning in, uh, and let's have a hand for this wonderful band. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. Settle down. Settle down out there. We don't want you getting too excited. All right, here we go with the tune called You Already Know.
All right, thank you very much. The, that last tune, again, was the Jonathan Raganese arrangement of an Emmett Cohen piece. And uh, we, we did the uh, Toast to Low, which was also written especially for this concert. And we also did uh, a name to be remembered by Isaac Amaya back there in the trumpet section. Uh, we want to thank you very much. And uh, this next portion of this concert is going to be amazing. We had some uh, great Zoom clinics this week. Uh, tremendous international piano player, monster player out there, one of the uh, folks that is just making some things happen. And all through COVID situation, he was doing house concerts and all, and they just were amazing. It was neat to tune in and watch and, and feel like something in the music world is happening, and they were making that happen. Uh, so you're going to just love this, this portion of the concert. Uh, again, we're so blessed to have Emmett Cohen here with us, with bassist Russell Hall, trumpet and vocal, uh, Benny Benack III. And uh, there's no more to say than, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together. Again, thank you for tuning in to the University of North Florida School of Music, Great American Jazz Series. And here is the Emmett Cohen Trio. Hey, everybody. Welcome to Emmett's Place. Um, I know you, some of you know it from our year-long now um, concert series here in the house, and it's such a pleasure to be here uh, for the 33rd annual Great American Jazz Series online, and we're doing a residency uh, here at, um, at UNF, and uh, we wish we could be there with you in person in Jacksonville, but lo and behold, we're here with you in person, um, I mean, in, in person virtually in Jacksonville, and that's uh, what, what we've been doing this year, that's, what, that's the theme of this year, and that's the theme of what jazz really means. Um, is about improvisation, it's about adaptability, it's about contouring to whatever the circumstances may be. And we, uh, we, we really appreciate you having us, hosting us. Um, and I'd like to introduce you to you, some of my great friends and quarantine buddies and uh, some of the great masters, young masters of jazz um, on, the, on the trumpet and also vocals, um, the one and only Pittsburgh native, uh, someone who's uh, not only brought joy to so many people around the world, um, but has inspired a whole generation of, of, of people to create vocalises, to, 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 to improve their scatting. Um, he's really become a figure in the arts and on the internet, and it's a real pleasure to see him uh, having such a wide reach. You probably know him already, the great Benny Benack III. Yeah. And behind, on uh, the bass holding it down, I always say the bass is the most important instrument in the band. Um, if you think of it like a house, this is the foundation in the band. This is the foundation. Without, without, without a strong foundation, the winds of May come and they blow over the house. Um, and that won't be happening today because we have one of the greats of all time playing the bass in the long lineage of um, Ron Carter, Ray Brown, Sam Jones, uh, Jimmy Blanton, Milt Hinton, many others. Um, he's internalized all of the sounds of the bass and translated them, them into something highly unique and highly personal. Um, he has uh, such an aptitude for composition, for the music, and sees it um, as the big picture, which always helps us to shape uh, the music in, in, in this particular direction. He's a leader, but he's also one of the great followers, and he's also one of the great spirits and personalities of all time. The great Mr. Russell Hall on the bass. Yeah. All right. And yours truly, Emmett Cohen. I'm playing piano today. And we thank you so much for having us, and we're going to kick things off uh, with a song that Benny did. I, I, I mentioned his aptitude for uh, creating uh, funny uh, little ways of, of engaging um, with, with, with jazz and making people really love the music. And this is one thing he did about a year ago. Uh, he created this song, and it got, got so popular on the internet, and we actually saw him on the news because of that. Uh, it's a take on Put On A Happy Face, which is designed to uplift from the, from the musical Bye Bye Birdie, and it's called Put A Mask On Your Face. So we're going to take it away with Mr. Benny Benack III. We hope you enjoy, and we'll see you in person soon. Corona's gonna clear up. Put a mask on your face. One like this will do. Brush off that cough and cheer up. But please don't leave your place. 
Don't be a tough guy and still go outside. <laughs> Can you believe the nerve? Above all else, self-quarantine and we'll flatten the curve. Pick out your favorite Netflix. FaceTime your friends and foes. Learn a few brand new card tricks, but don't touch your face or nose. And don't spread Corona all over the place. Just put a mask on your face. Cough and cheer up, but please do not leave your place. Don't be a tough guy and still go outside. Ha, can you believe the nerve? Above all else, self quarantine and we'll flat in the curb. Learn how to cook a new dish. Whoa, try out a yoga pose. Grant yourself any old wish. Marie Kondo, all your clothes. Don't spread.
my favorite composer of the Great American Songbook, Mr. Cole Porter. It's all right with me. It's the wrong time and the wrong place. Though your face is charming, it's the wrong face. It's not her face, but such a charming face that it's all right with me. Oh, it's the wrong song in the wrong style. Though your smile is lovely, it's the wrong smile. Well, it's not her smile, but such a lovely smile. So it's all right with me. You can't know how happy I am that we've met. I'm strangely attracted to you. There's someone I'm trying so hard to forget. Don't you want to forget someone too? It's the wrong game with the wrong chips. Although your lips are tempting, they're the wrong lips. Well, they're not her lips, but they're such tempting lips that if some night you're free, well, here it's all right, oh, it's all right. Well, it's all right with me. You all right with a little bit of Emmett over there?
I'm strangely attracted to you. There's someone I'm trying so hard to forget. Don't you want to forget someone too? It's the wrong game with the wrong chips. Though your lips are tempting, they're the wrong lips. Well, they're not her lips, but they're such tempting lips that if some night, oh, you're free. Well, it's all right, baby, it's all right. Well, it's all right with me. Oh. Cole Porter to Mr. Louis Armstrong.
Snuck it in there. Snuck it in there in the last minute. We got there. Took till the last out of the ninth inning. We got it. We got it. <laughs> so what do we got so far, Emmett? We hit Mr. Cole Porter. We hit the great Louis Armstrong. Yeah, that was uh, I Surrender Deer. Tell him about it. I surrender dear. That's Harry right. Barris. One of one of my certainly one of my biggest influences, not only as a trumpet player but as a vocalist, the great Louis Armstrong, and uh, something that you know Russell and Emmett, myself, I think we all pride ourselves on is uh, you know honoring all of the masters and heroes of this music from every era, from every decade, from every style. So you know that's what we're trying to give all of you here today. I think is a little bit of a uh, you know cornucopia of the music, if you will. So. Pardon us for time traveling a little bit, but uh, Russell has a penchant for time travel. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. We all uh, we all love so so much of this music. So we're jumping around a little bit, having a great time, and now we're going to do a song from one of the great jazz composers. I know one of Emmett's big heroes, the great Cedar Anthony Walton.
Thank you so much. I hope you all are doing well. Um, if, uh, if, if you're wondering where we are right now, we're in Harlem, uh, right on the old Edgecombe Avenue, which is the street that Duke Ellington lived, the street that uh, uh, all his band members lived. Billy Holiday uh, was, lived down here. Lester Young, Coleman Hawkins, they, 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 they hung out around here. Um, Mary Lou Williams lived right just up the block on Convent, a couple of blocks uh, up. And uh, it's a very, very magical place, rich with the history of so much of this music. And uh, since we're with, within and amongst the spirits, we, we always honor it the best we can. Uh, what do you think? You want to play a little something from, from Harlem? Let's do it. What do you got up there? <laughs> um, and a, a lot of the nature of, of how we do things, you know, I don't know if I introduced these guys yet, but this is Benny Benack the Third on the trumpet, and that's Russell Hall on the bass. My name is Emmett Cohen on the piano, and it's, uh, it's, 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 it's a pleasure to play music with these gentlemen, especially because it's been so long. We, uh, Russell and I at least moved to New York about eight years ago. Um, we were both living in Miami before that, coincidentally, where we met. And uh, I, I'd, I'd known Benny from the now defunct uh, Grammy band, and so we've been friends since high school, and I think Benny and Russell met in New York, and uh, it's been eight years of um, playing jam sessions, making music, um, you know, really just cultivating our sound, our scene, and doing what we can to, to, to further this music in many different directions. And uh, yeah, we're gonna play, what are we gonna play?
That's the beautiful Benny Benack the third. Duke Ellington's Come Sunday. That's right. Statue Come Sunday. Just down yonder. Yeah, I talked about Duke Ellington and Benny said we got to play some Duke <laughs> Ellington. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, we go from Duke Ellington. Let's go down the street. Yeah. Minton's Playhouse. Okay. Thelonious. Yeah, okay. You're thinking about Thelonious? Sure. Is that what you're saying? Or are you uh, saying yeah, something else? I mean, they were all there. They were all in Minton's. They were all there. <laughs> Minton's the Playhouse. Artists. We're taking a tour of Harlem now, but uh, we're going to play some bebop for you. Let's see what, what comes out. Careful. Ah. Maestro Hall.
Thelonious Monk, in walked Bud. That's right, down to Minton's Playhouse. <laughs> so now that we've covered our uh, neighborhood here in Harlem, we might as well take you a little bit on a journey around the world as uh, we are all doing so much in the past year. We have all been, uh, you know, having to just visualize ourselves in, uh, you know, happier places or warmer places or something like that. And I've gotten in the habit of saying, hey, you know, wherever you are in the world, now we're going to do a song from, uh, you know, Brazil and we're going to imagine yourself on a beach. So that is uh, what we're going to do. We're going to give you a little bit of a Brazilian treatment to a wonderful old standard entitled You're My Everything. And, you know, depending on when this airs, it might still be a little chilly wherever we are in the world. So if, you, if necessary, you can just picture yourself on a beach somewhere warm for this one. Or maybe you can just step outside. I don't know, this thing might run forever, so. <laughs> and do it in C for me, please. <laughs> You're my everything underneath the sun. You're my everything rolled up into one. You're my only dream, my only real reality. You're my idea of a perfect personality. You're my everything, everything I need. You're the song I sing and in the book I read. You're a way beyond belief, oh, and just to make it brief. You're my winter, summer, spring, my everything. Let me get some percussion. We're in Brazil. Into one. 
You're my only dream, my only real reality. You are my idea of a perfect personality. You're my everything, everything I need. You're the song I sing. You're my winter, summer, spring. You're my winter, summer, spring. My everything. How could I forget the egg shakers at the beginning of that one? <laughs> wow. Yeah, there you go. There you go, Andrew. We might be uh, well, keeping it moving here. <laughs> Definitely keeping it moving. We just want to thank you all so much for, for enlisting us to do this performance. It really does mean a lot. And, um, and it's, it's been a tough year for a lot of people. Um, and one way we found to, to get through it is you know, just by the joy of music in general, just be, being able to connect virtually with people, doing, doing what we can um, to, to, to bring some joy to the world. And that's you know, the ultimate message of what this music is supposed to be about. It's supposed to be about the joy, the, the feeling, the hope for the future, um, the ability to imagine something better for, the, for, the, for yourself and the people you love, and to remember to spread that love and to spread that message. It, it's supposed to be infectious. So you know, we want you to, to, to take that and, and multiply it, spread it. Spread the message um, and, and, and listen to some jazz in your life. You know, go home and turn on that Miles Davis, that Charlie Parker, that Louis Armstrong, and um, you know, it'll help you. It'll help you in your life in ways you could not have imagined. Let's play, uh, let's, do a, let's do a, let's play some blues because that's the one thing we haven't covered yet. Right? Let's do it, yeah. I was gonna ask Russell, help us out on this blues. This is, this is, uh, this is, this is gonna be the quarantine blues but the 20, 2021 version, <laughs> with more hope than the 2020 oh, version. There you go. Yeah, see, that's a hopeful tempo right there. That's not a dreary blues. That's a light at the end of the tunnel blues.
see my baby She said, put on your mask, I ain't gonna ask you twice I went to see my baby She said, you better put on that mask, don't make me ask you twice The first time she said she's gonna say it But the second time it won't be so nice Oh, I went to see my baby She was acting oh so mean I said I went to go and see my baby She was acting real mean She said you're not setting foot inside this door baby Till you go and get yourself that vaccine Oh, the quarantine blues They're gonna be over real soon Everybody just, just hold the line You'll be feeling fine in no time Oh, the light's at the end of the tunnel We're gonna get through this together Oh, baby, that's right, we're gonna get through this together. Oh! How can you not feel the joy of jazz when it's swinging like that, ladies and gentlemen? I'll tell you what. Thank you all so much. We really, really had a good time. We appreciate all you out at UNF. Um, we hope we can be with you in Jacksonville soon. And uh, we want to uh, give a big shout out to J.B. Scott, who's doing great things out there. Thank you so much for uh, putting this together, reaching out. And I also want to thank Jonathan Raganese, uh, who did the arrangements that were, that were featured in the first set. You know, little known secret, I lived with Jonathan Raganese in uh, my first year in New York on 109th Street. Um, over by Smoke Jazz Club, and he's one of the most incredible uh, composers and arrangers of our time, so thank you to him. Thank you to all you guys. Um, you guys are playing so great, and we hope to see you and connect with you in person. Once again, Benny Benack on the trumpet, Russell Hall on the bass, yours truly, Emmett Cohen. Thank you so much, and have a good one. Peace. <laughs>